All right, so your Power Air Fryer oven is amazing, right? Because it air fries, it fries with air instead of oil. It's also a rotisserie, but on top of that, we inserted a dehydration function. So it's all of those three machines. It's not just okay at being those three machines, it's great at being those three machines. So now I'm gonna show you how easy it is to dehydrate food. You can get the recipes and the times online. Typically when you dehydrate, you dehydrate all of the same or like-timed items at the same time. In this case, I'm just gonna show you three different things. These would take three different times, but I wanna show you the finished product as well because they come out so perfect in the Power Air Fryer oven with the, de with the dehydrator. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add about two tablespoons of olive oil. Now, this is just broccoli. Fresh broccoli, florets, we just cut the little tops off. And then I have, um, this is mac and cheese powder. This is the same powder that you would put on your mac and cheese uh, out of the box. Believe it or not, they sell this um, on its own, which is kind of fun. Just another fun little uh, seasoning. Now, you're not putting a ton of seasoning on there, but you do want to give it, you know, like a nice flavor. So instead of eating potato chips, you're going to be eating broccoli and mac and cheese chips. And um, man, they're super healthy, way healthier than a potato chip. So uh, trust me, even that little bit of powder, these still are crazy good and crazy healthy. So then what you do is you just uh, put these out here just like this. You line them all up. And then uh, you just put them in the power air fryer oven with a couple of touches of a button. You will be able to finish these off. Uh, they take pretty much overnight. So you're gonna put them in, you're gonna go to sleep, you're gonna wake up, you're gonna wake up to a delicious treat. Um, that's one idea. So we would do broccoli with mac and cheese. How about some cauliflower with sriracha powder? Sriracha powder has been around for a long time, but man, has it become very popular lately. So again, we're gonna put a couple tablespoons of olive oil with the sriracha powder. And again, guys, this is so healthy. That little bit of olive oil, olive oil's good for you. You're not putting a lot, and the sriracha powder is pretty much calorie free. So you just wanna incorporate those. Again, you're just gonna put those out on the tray as well. Here's another fun idea. So kale chips, I'm sure you've heard of them by now. Again, super trendy food because they're really healthy. Um, like spinach, they have great nutritional value, lots of iron, all sorts of good stuff in there. Now, we're just gonna take a little bit of, um, this is like dried onion soup mix, and we're just gonna sprinkle that over just to give them a little bit of flavor. And we're, they're, they're, trust me, it's still really healthy. You're not ruining your kale chips by putting a little bit of this powder on there. You wanna make it healthy and delicious too, right? So you're just gonna give everything a little twist incorporate all of that uh, delicious flavor, and then you just lay them out again. Just like air frying, you never wanna stack anything on top. You always wanna give everything as much room as possible. But with these kale chips, don't worry about crowding them. Just don't stack them, because when you're finished, when they dehydrate, they shrink up a little bit. But all of these vegetables are still considered raw because you're cooking them at a very low temperature over a very long period of time. So they never heat up and ruin the nutrients inside. So dehydrating is healthy, it's easy, and it can be ridiculously tasty. All right, so we dehydrated these at each had their own temperature and time, but they all come out great. So check this out. Here's our broccoli with our cheddar cheese rub or our cheddar cheese powder. Here's our cauliflower with our sriracha powder. This is what it looked like going in. This is what it looks like coming out. It looks good, doesn't it? It looks really tasty. Our kale chips, the same thing. We have that French onion soup mix on those. So when you're dehydrating, it takes a little bit of time, but it's so worth it because it's really healthy, really delicious, easy to do in the power air fryer oven because we can dehydrate in there and you have a delicious tasty treat for yourself and give your kids. Now, you can put these on top of salad. You can put them on top of steak. They, they work with a whole bunch of things. You don't just have to eat them as a snack. All right, I hope you fall in love with dehydrating like I did. And you're gonna really, this is my favorite right there. I love that mac and cheese powder. I can't help it.